Thanks, Tony. This afternoon, the governor warns Placer, Butte, and Lake Counties have fewer than 20% of their hospital beds available. And Stanislaus County now has the highest positivity rate anywhere in the state. So how soon will that county start up its surge plan? CBS 13, Renee Santos is in Modesto getting answers for us. Renee. Yeah, I've been making calls for the past two weeks now, trying to get someone from the public health department here in Stanislaus County to talk to us. Meantime, hospitals here in this county are stretched thin. Kaiser just getting back to me this afternoon, telling me their hospitals are managing the growing number of hospital cases. An increase in cases is having a direct impact on hospitals in Stanislaus County, many pulling resources to meet the need. The county currently dealing with the highest positivity rate in the state, sitting at 15.3%. ICU bed availability, 38%. Governor Newsom sounding the alarm just hours ago. This continues to be a deadly disease. This continues to be a disease uh, that puts people in our ICUs, in our hospitals, and is currently putting a strain on our hospital system and in our ICUs. Terry Withrow is Stanislaus County District 3 Board Supervisor. He gives us insight on the concerns within hospitals in the county. The biggest issue we've found and what we're being told by the hospitals is not necessarily bed space as it is staffing. CBS 13 went directly to Kaiser and Doctors Hospital for answers on current bed capacity in their facilities. While doctors didn't get back to us, Kaiser says it has maintained readiness. Right now, their hospitals aren't at capacity, and TELUS supplies are on standby to increase capacity if needed. So if extra staff is needed, where would those resources come from, and what exactly is the county's surge plan? We'll have more of that coming up at 5. All right, a lot of factors to consider. Thanks so much, Renee.